Hello, student. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. Sou o professor Júnior Gonçalves e estou aqui para ministrar mais uma aula para vocês. E na aula de hoje iremos falar sobre do or does. Do or does is a auxiliary verb. It is very important in English, English classes. Next, do versus does. To make a question in English, we normally use do or does. It's normally put at the beginning of the question, before the subject. Affirmative, you speak Spanish. Question, do you speak Spanish? You'll see that we add do at the beginning of the affirmative sentence to make a question. We use do when the subject is I, you, we, or they. Affirmative, he speaks Spanish. Question, does he speak Spanish? When the subject is he, she, or it, we add does at the beginning to make the affirmative sentence a question. Note that the letter S at the end of the verb in the affirmative sense, because it's the third person, disappear in the question. We will see the reason why below. We don't use do or does in a questions that have the verb to be our model verbs. Can, must, might, should, etc. Next. Word order of question with do and does. The following is the word order to construct the basic question. In English, it is do or does. Do I have cereal for breakfast? Do you have cereal for breakfast? Do we cereal for breakfast? Do they have cereal for breakfast? In this case, we have do because the subject is I or you or we or they. Next, if you use he, she or it, you have to use this. Does he eat cereal for breakfast? Does she cereal for breakfast? Does it eat Cereal for breakfast. Verb. The verb that goes here is the base form of the infinitive, like the infinitive without to before the verb. Instead of the infinitive to have, it's just the have part. Remember that the infinitive is the verb before it's conjugated, changed, and it begins with to. For example, to have. To eat, to go, to live, to speak. Next, examples of questions with do and does. Do you speak English? Does John speak French? Do you have for a quick drink? Does it rain a lot of the south? Do they want to come with me? Does she like chocolate? Repeat, do you speak English? Does John speak French? Do we have time for a quick drink? Does it rain a lot in the south? Do they want to come with me? Does she like chocolate? Next. Short answers with do and does. In questions that use do or does, it's possible to give short answers to direct questions as follows. Simple questions. Do you speak English? Yes, I do. Or negative form. No, I don't. Do you? I need a dictionary. Yes, you do. No, you don't. Do you both speak English? Yes, we do. No. We don't. Do they speak English? Yes, they do. No, they don't. Does he speak English? Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Does she speak English? Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Does it have four legs? Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. 
Russian word is with do and does. The order for making sentence with question words is the following. What do you have breakfast? What do you have for breakfast? What does she have for breakfast? Where do you live? When do you study? How do you spell your name? If you can, repeat after me. What do you have for breakfast? What do you have for breakfast? What does she have for breakfast? What does she have for breakfast? Where do you live? Where do you live? When do you study? When do you study? How do you spell your name? How do you spell your name? So guys, that is all folks. See you next class.